for an occasion. I'll read that again. For an occasion, like this, uh, I want to make sure I keep up the traditions of being a best man. Uh, apparently, I need to get the groom to the church on time. Tick. Uh, I need to remember the rings. Did that. And I need to have sex with a bridesmaid. Wait. I, to be fair, I, maybe when they're older. Happy 10-day anniversary. What is it? I saw you looking at it online the other day. Two Asian lesbians and a man who looks like a fat Jesus. I thought I got it made. I married a doctor. First word. First word. Um, um, red. Um, red. Um, red. Sick. Lazy. Uh, stupid. Disappointment. That was nine months ago. And it's just something in our marriage that hasn't quite Clicked. gelled. You realise you've married beneath yourself. You thought it could be someone better looking. Better body. Uh, no. No. Right, so were there terrible sexual problems? Hmm. Oh, he's lovely. I don't know how you let her slip away. No. She's too nice. She's too perfect. Holy sh. Guy, right? Yeah. It's just your type, really. You're my type. I don't really go for good looking. <gasps> I need to be with you, Ned. I'm sorry, but that dove is getting awfully close to the ceiling fan. I'm not giving up. From the minute I met you, I thought of nothing else. <laughs> Nat's kind, boring, warm, warm. Put the radio on if you want warm. Good with kids. So was Michael Jackson. It's a shame that they couldn't put your brain in her body. Do you know what I mean? That would be amazing. Although you'd be left with her brain in your body. Imagine that. Oh my god, it's like Frankenstein, but with like boobs. Ah. No, joking. I do ya. And we literally never see another penis again. In all fairness, you've probably seen enough to be getting on with now, haven't you? I'm not calling you a whore, but I also am. Digital We've got a camera on us, we'll have to try it out later. Morocco, that's the hotel, and that's... Oh, that's doggy style. <laughs>